Hi friends, this is Rishabh Kapoor from WebSoftTutorials.com. In this tutorial, guys, I'll show you how to insert an image in HTML document. And after that, I will show you how to resize images according to our requirement. So, firstly, I will tell you, guys, you can insert images in HTML document using image tags, and its syntax is img src, which means the source of the file or the image where the image has been saved equal to we will write the source in between these quotes after that a forward slash and a closing bracket guys some tags in HTML are closed like this like input tags and image tags about input tags I will teach you uh, in upcoming tutorials so guys in source we will write the location of the file or image my image file will saved in a image folder and the name of the file is Rayan and it is a jpg file so I will type image Rayan dot jpg jpg is its extension so I have to write it also so if I will refresh it you, you will see the image has been displayed on HTML document so guys you will you can see that the image size is very large according to the web page so we will adjust it using height and width attributes firstly we will use height equal to adjust according to your requirements full time height 100 and width equal to 150 if I will refresh it you will, you can see the height and the width of image has been adjusted guys it has one more attribute that is alt which is for alternate text means if the image is not working due to some problems like you have typed a wrong source so the image will not work or you have deleted the image from that location so the image will not work in that case this text will be displayed I will write Rehan's image if we will refresh it you will see nothing because the image is displayed is displaying and it is in the right location so if I will type uh, something wrong like RYN but that may um, its original name is Rian. so it will not be displayed but the text will be displayed so we can say that alt tag is used to used for alternate text for the image if I will type the correct name then the image will be displayed not the text um, and guys it is recommended in HTML always use alt tags otherwise if you will validate it W3 uh, standards it will return an error so thanks for watching this video guys let's see in the next tutorial